This is a specimen of a heart that is transversely sectioned through the left ventricle and the right ventricle. And uh, we can see over this area at the uh, antero and septal region of the left ventricle wall that there is this area of pallor. It is uh, irregular. It looks a little bit friable, which means it's sort of crumbling a little bit. And there are some foci of darker blackish hemorrhage within this region. So this is a classical appearance of coagulative necrosis. And what is the reason for this necrosis? The most likely reason is ischemia. So thinking about what can cause ischemia to the heart, um, this is actually visible also in this specimen. And we are looking in this region here. This is actually the left anterior descending coronary artery. So I'm just going to um, magnify this area. And if you look at the vessel, uh, you'll see that it is not patent. What the vessel contains is a thrombus. And uh, if you remember, a thrombus is the formation of a clot within an intravascular space. So this is an example of thrombosis of the coronary artery that is leading to myocardial infarction. And again, if you remember, the definition of infarction is necrosis due to ischemia.